Chairman Cusson, committee members, thank you for this opportunity to speak today. Representative Glover, thank you for your service to your community. The oil and gas industry looks forward to continuing to work with you and all of the Haynesville area and coexisting as good neighbors. It is times like these we realize how important the oil and gas industry is to the entire world. <clears throat> I'm extremely proud that between Shreveport area's Haynesville Shell and Cameron Parish's LNG presence, that Louisiana is making a huge difference in the world stage right now. Natural gas from Shreveport literally fueled Europe all winter and has stepped up even more during this Russian-Ukraine conflict. Our Haynesville shale play is not only the premier natural gas play in the United States, but an economic force in Louisiana. Besides the, stakes, the, the state's intake on severance taxes on natural gas in 2021 of 120 million, the Haynesville parishes collected nearly $107 million in ad valorem taxes or property taxes from oil and gas companies last year. With 41 rigs drilling in the Haynesville today, with an average of 36 workers uh, per rig, that's about 1,500 rig workers. That's not to mention the thousands of service company workers that participate in the drilling, completing, and production phases of the well. Fracking has been safely used in the United States since 1947. More than 1.7 million wells have been completed using the fracking process in the United States, producing more than 7 billion barrels of oil and 6 trillion cubic feet of gas. By safely unlocking America's abundant natural resources, fracking has created millions of American jobs, reduced energy prices, brought cleaner air by significantly reducing U.S. greenhouse gas emissions to a 25-year low, and it strengthened our national security and transformed the United States into a global superpower. Oil and gas companies are working with regula regulators set forth by the uh, Office of Conservation and the Department of Natural Resources, as well as working directly with the parish officials as issues arise. LOGA urges the committee to vote against this bill as it is another measure that will push investment out of our great state. Thank you.